Hello YouTube, welcome to Unbox with Alex Trent and today we are going to unbox Cox Mini Box Easy to Install Digital Adapter Kit. So this is a kind of like a receiver but not a complete receiver but I'm going to bring up a my phone to compare the mini box to the uh, advanced TV receiver. Compare all Go all digital equipment options. Here are the features is the mini box does not have all the features that the TV receiver such as um, advanced TV pack. So the only uh, features that the mini box has is it can have HD channels, on screen guide, um, parental controls, small profile size which the um, obviously the advanced TV receiver Wax and has a remote control and and that's about it. A bit before we unbox, let's check a look around the box. Cox Mini Box. On this side of the box, we have um, Mini Box easy to install adapter kit. Nothing on the back, but just this. Um, pause the video if you want to read this part. HD compatible and important information. Pause the video if you want to read this part. So nothing on the sides. Serial numbers and let's finally unbox this thing. Uh, for more information go to your Cox, Infor um, Cox Solutions store. If you don't know what that is, uh, look it up online. And here's my unboxing knife. It's just a slit for here and finally let's lift it up let's see what's inside once um, we uh, lift the top box up we have our easy startup guide and on this side um, on this side of the box like I'm gonna give you a different angle on this side of the box uh, at a different angle we have our simple diagram to how to connect the uh, mini box. So let's see here. Turn off TV, disconnect cable from TV, uh, reconnect cable to mini box. And step two is for HDTV, connect power last, and yeah, turn on TV. And it's basically a simple. Um, diagram to how to connect this thing. So connect color coded that cable ends. Yeah, whatever. But anyway, pause the video if you want to. Um, if you want to read it, but we're gonna move on to the. We're gonna continue the unboxing. Here we again. We have our um, startup guide, easy uh, setup guide. It includes the mini box remote, HDMI cable, um, coax cable, correct me if I'm wrong, grammar police, language police, and power cord. Powers the mini box. So, simple guide here's step one, step two. the cables step three connecting your power uh, adapter step four if you need the HDMI cable in step two and here's the remote um, which is supplied in there and using the guide uh, controlling what your kids can watch parental controls Turn, turning on closed captions, stuff like that, FAQs, notes, and coxconserves.com. This guide is recyclable. So remember to recycle and go to cox.com, go all digital for more information about this uh, mini box or call 1-866-961-0416. Anyway, moving on, let's see what's under this 
cardboard, and under the cardboard we get um, this mini box remote control program your remote and here is a pamphlet so before you can program your remote here are the method A, method B the camera is hard to focus so yeah pause the video if you want to read this part I'm trying to make the video short so we can get to the to this but before we do this we have this and I'm going to use the HDMI cord but not this so follow instructions follow instructions or the diagram on top to follow it but if you don't have a HDMI port or ran out of HDMI ports on your television or display you might need this but if you do have an available HDMI port and you're going to need this because it's just easier all you have to do is connect the blue part to the cable to the mini box and this to the television. Anyway, we have step two. And what's this? And we have our remote. Nice enough that they include batteries. And we have our power adapter. So let's finally let me look at the um, the mini power box, I mean mini cable box, or mini box. Here, this is what it looks like. This is how, um, got to take it out of the bag to let you see the thing. Yeah. So it could shell, put that back in the box, and here is the uh, cox. The mini box. So for size comparison, if you want to know how this big, um, you know what? If you want to know how big this is, is this is my Samsung Galaxy S3, a 4.8 uh, inch display. So this is smaller than that. It's for for only the size comparison. So it's it's pretty small. Let's finally connect it to the TV. So we have our cable from the wall to TV, our switch, uh, IN, HDMI, and power cable. So let's finally connect it to the TV. So we're gonna. So I'm gonna pause the video, and it's pre pretty simple setup if you follow instructions. So I'm going to pause the video and come back to uh, check it out. So I just connected, um, did the, connected my antenna cable to this, uh, connected my HDMI cable to the television from the mini box, and this is the power uh, adapter, which you connect to your wall adapter, I mean your wall outlet, to this. And right now, um, this is connected to the TV and it's doing a running self test, connectivity test, and updating software, which is currently right now. And this is what the remote looks like a simple, small remote. And for size comparison, this is what it looks like much bigger than your 4.8 inch phone. If you like this video, please give this video a thumbs up in the video below. Uh, comment in the comment section below on what you think about this uh, mini box and please like share and subscribe to my youtube channel for more unboxings and thank you for watching unbox with Alex Trin and I'll see you on the next video